Good afternoon, gentlemen of the press. On behalf of my commander general, Dr. Hamid Abubakar Haudi, MNI Hurafar, I welcome you all to the national headquarters of the Nigeria Security and Civil Defense Corps, Abuja. In line with our commitment to continue to keep the media and members of the public abreast with some of our activities, we decided to call this press briefing. And uh, today we have a snapshot of our major achievement in this month of March. And we are glad to let you know that this great effort was carried out by the Intelligence and Investigation Department of the Nigeria Security and Field Fence Corps National Headquarters. Um, today, the 20th of March, 2024, uh, the Nigeria Security and Field Fence Corps will be parading seven suspects. And as we all know that the Nigeria Security and Field Defense Corps in its resolve to enhance the security architecture of the nation through intelligent gathering, safeguarding critical national assets and infrastructure, ensuring the training, supervising, monitoring, and issuance of operational license to practitioners of private security guards companies, disaster management, among others. We have made a laudable achievement by arresting of these seven suspects for illegal possession of firearms in Abuja Metropolis. The Directorate of Intelligence and Investigation on Surveillance and Monitoring have foiled the operations of seven suspects arrested for manufacturing rifles and pistols. The arrest was made possible through a tip-off that some group of people were manufacturing rifles and pistols in Abuja. The Directorate of Intelligence and Investigation on Surveillance and Monitoring swung into action and apprehended seven suspects and recovered five rifles and one pistol. The names of the suspects are as follows. Amos Yao, 29 years male. Jonah Manafe, 27 years male. Ezekiel Nanim, 20 years male. Nefa Pando, 26 years female. Ufemia Peter, 26 years male. Faith Gadan, 20 years female. And Philemon Kalam, 26 years female. The following exhibits were recovered from the suspect. Five already fabricated rifles, one pistol, one unfinished rifle, seven empty cartridges, two boots, rods, welding machine, filing machine, two searchlights, three pliers, shovel, cutlasses, and axes, under the ID cards and belts. From the statement volunteered by one Amos Iao, who happens to be the leader of the gang, he confirmed that he has been in possession of the pistol since he partook in civilian JTF operations in Durumi, Abuja. During our preliminary investigation, we gathered none of the already manufactured pistols or rifles have been sold out yet. The Common in General, Ahmed Abubakar Haudi, MNI OFR, has charged the senior management staff officers to increase their intelligent base and to be more proactive than reactive. The call will continue to synergize with relevant security agencies to strengthen the nation's security architecture. And in conclusion, we implore all our innocent citizens to please work with we security agencies because these people, they are not ghosts. They are human beings and they live with us. At the Nigeria Security and Civil Defense Corps, we believe so much in this cliche. That is, when you see something, uh, please say something. That is how we will be able to carry out our investigation. And so, you people out there, we need to know, you need to know something that security is a collective responsibility. So we have to do it all together. My Commander in General, Dr. Hamed Abubakar Haudi, MNI OFR, has assured all Nigerians that with their support, crimes and criminality will be nipping the bud and it will be a thing of the past in our country. On this note, I thank you all for coming around to showcase our success story. I thank you very much.